It was a remarkable council year with many planned activities well executed. A lot was done this year. Our activities were focused on many areas including the membership, general public, important public health issues and improving the quality of the public health services. The College of Community Physicians is the premier association of public health professionals in Sri Lanka. The college has many objectives. Of those, one of the main objectives is to promote public health in the general population. In addition, the college promotes postgraduate education in community medicine in Sri Lanka. During the current tenure of the council, our activities were focused mainly to achieve the objectives of the college. In order to achieve the objectives, we carried out many activities including many programs covering many aspects to the membership as well as the public. We were able to successfully achieve the, our planned activities and achieve the objectives of the college. Let us have a look at the wonderful work that was finished over the council year. Journal Club Six journal clubs featuring significant and timely topics were held. These articles have been presented, critically analyzed and thoroughly discussed by our membership. Out of many, a significant journal club was organized by the collaboration with the Sri Lankan College of Endocrinologists and the College of Community Physicians. The Young Community Physicians Forum The Young Community Physicians Forum served as the forum for community physicians to discuss vital issues relating to both public health and their own profession. Some of the topics that discussed were the impact of economic crisis on our health system, looking after our mind and money amidst the economic crisis, and what you should know about publishing your research findings. Capacity Building Programs The CCPSL ran capacity building programs for many health categories that provide public health services. These include workshops on research methodology for public health staff in Kandy District, online courses for MOHs on court procedures, CPD sessions for MOH staff in Western Province, training programs for staff members involved in maternal and child health in Western Province, and supportive supervision of MOH offices in the Western Province. In conducting activities, the college went beyond Colombo. College reached the periphery for the provincial level. College conducted capacity building programs for public health staff in 20 districts. The college covered the subject areas of migration health, filaria, malaria, STD AIDS, tuberculosis and health security. We were able to train over 1000 public health staff in 20 districts. It was a very successful program where the mode of delivery was appreciated by most of the participants. Once more, the college offered a 13-week community medicine review course to assist candidates preparing for very important MSc community medicine screening examination. Public Awareness Activities CCPSL carried out an array of public awareness campaigns throughout the council year on current issues that affected the general public. These include webinars, television and radio programs, press conferences, press releases, as well as newspaper articles. Membership Activities 
For the membership, the college conducted a webinar as a guidance session for trainings in community medicine. Again, discussions were conducted by the college to exploring the challenges faced by the trainees in community medicine. Again, the quarterly newspapers were published in the month of November 2022, March 2023, and June 2023. Orations Dr. F. A. Vikramasinghe Oration and Dr. A. V. K. V. De Silva Oration were conducted by CCPSL. Social Activities the College of Community Physicians of Sri Lanka proudly presented the CCPSL Talent Show 2023, showcasing the amazing talents of members of CCPSL. The annual cricket encounter of College of Community Physicians and Ceylon College of Physicians were held with the participation of members of both colleges. Collaborative activities with other professional organizations. The CCPSL collaborated with other professional colleges and organizations in doing activities such as conducting monthly clinical meetings with the Sri Lanka Medical Association. Moreover, a series of training workshops were conducted in collaboration with the College of Palliative Medicine on carrying out systematic reviews for the postgraduate trainees. The council year was quite successful and productive. Numerous activities have been effectively planned and executed. We have developed a new website containing a brand new interface that includes a wide variety of content with user-friendly navigation with frequent updates. Social networking is currently the finest way to communicate and share knowledge. Every activity was regularly updated and disseminated among our members and the public, utilizing an audience-friendly, unique style on our Facebook and YouTube channel. As you were already seen, this was a truly amazing and very productive council year, both academically and non-academically.